Hey guys, today I have a new update for my Project 5 uses. If you haven't been following along with this project, what I'm doing is whenever I get something new in my collection, it goes in a bin and then I slowly work my way through it using each product five times and then we talk about them here. So, Nugget is playing over here in my drawer. So if you hear her, that is what's going on. Um, but let's get into it. I have a few products here to talk about and yeah, let's get into it. First, we have my ABH Dip Brow Pomade and Ash Brown. I didn't buy this. This was sent to me from BoxyCharm. Um, they sent me like the wrong order. She's like digging in there. Um, anyway, they sent me the wrong order. So this does not match my brows at all. It's very, very dark. I did try it in my brows once and like it just looked black. It didn't look good. Um, so I ended up using this as an eyeliner and I do really like it as an eyeliner. So it is categorized in my inventory as a gel liner. And that's just how I'm gonna use it. It's a nice charcoal, not charcoal. It's a nice like chocolatey dark brown. And yeah, I liked it. It was free, so like I didn't have to pay for it. So yeah, I like it. I like it as a liner. Next, another brow product. This is from Billion Dollar Brows. This is the Universal Brow Pencil. And this is what it looks like. Another BoxyCharm item, I believe. This is the like bigger pencil. I have another one that's a micro pencil. And I believe I also have one that is like slanted. Um, I have a bunch of these. I really like this brand for eyebrows. Um, I get a lot of their products through BoxyCharm and FabFitFun. But I've been enjoying it. I'm currently using their brow clear brow gel. And I really like it. Um... But yeah, and it's a really good color. I do wish that it wouldn't be universal because obviously it's not going to work for everybody. Um, I think they should just come out with colors, which my other pencils, I do believe, have colors because I think I have them in taupe. So I don't know if it's just that specific one that is just universal or what's going on there, but I do like it. It's pretty creamy, so if you don't like a creamy brow pencil, um, I would check out their other products if you're interested um, in this brand. But this one is the Universal Brow Pencil. Yeah, that's really all it says. Um, but yeah, this one's pretty creamy. They have other, my other two are like more stiffer. Okay, we have this little <laughs> sample guy. This is from Buxom. It is their Shiny Liquid Lipstick in Vava Plump. And obviously I was able to use this. I've had this for a while. I don't remember where I got it from. It probably came in a Sephora um, free sample. This is the color. It is a really pretty color. Um, for me to get this to work though, I just put a couple dots on and mixed it in with other lipsticks um, to wear on the daily, but it is a really pretty like magenta color. Um, and I liked the formula. It was decent. I'm not a huge liquid lipstick person. Let me get this off before it stains. Like I said, I'm not a huge liquid, liquid lipstick person. Um, but I do like to mix them with lipsticks and it kind of just adds like a little bit of a stain. Um, so I liked it for that purpose. Next we have a blush. This is Tarte Peaceful. Guys, I bought this forever ago, it feels like. I think it honestly was last year's Black Friday sale. I think. So I've had this kicking around for a while. This is what it looks like. I remember being a little bit disappointed because it wasn't the color of the packaging. It's definitely more pink. Um, and usually their blushes are the color of the packaging, so. I was a l I remember being a little bit disappointed when I first opened it based on that, but it is a really pretty blush. I love the Tarte formula. It's, I mean, everybody knows this formula. It's a very good blush. So, um, I like it. It's good. And then we have a concealer. This is a BoxyCharm item. This is from Item Beauty, which I think is Addison Rae. 
I think. I don't know. Um, this is the Air Hug Concealer in shade 110. I actually really like this. Um, I've been skeptical, like, trying her products because they are, like, a little cheaper and, I don't know, celebrity brands usually I feel like aren't the best quality, but I like it, actually, and the, the wand is weird. The wand is definitely weird, but, um, I do remember liking it. I've heard good things about their mascara, too. Um, I haven't tried it, but I did buy it for my mom for Christmas, so we'll see if she likes it. You can find those products on BoxyCharm for, like, super cheap, by the way. Okay, I've got two eyeshadow products, and then we're done. We have from Smashbox, this is the... Photo Edit Eye Trio in a Blaze. I've had this kicking a while around in my box for a while, um, but this is what it looks like. Really pretty, just fall colors. The formula is great on this. You get like this champagne gold shimmer. You get this orangey bronze, and then this one is like a semi matte. I would say there's like a little bit of a sheen to it, but not really. Um, and it's like a reddish burnt orange kind of color um I like it I thought it made like a pretty nice look if you were to just use all three of these and yeah it was a very creamy formula like very soft I like it and then lastly we have from Violet Boss this is the Violet Sunset Palette I've been really enjoying these little palettes from her I get them quite often in BoxyCharm, but this one I just really enjoyed for summer. Um, the color story, it was just really pretty. Um, but I also do really like mauvey pinks, purple, champagne -y, gold. Like, this is like my color story. I think I reached for, I think I reached for everything except maybe these two darker shades. And I remember really liking it. I remember... Let's see. Let's do a few swatches. So this is peach. It has kind of like a pinky shift to it, but they're just so soft and pigmented. Um, Violet Sky is the purple shimmer. Let's go down here. Really pretty. And then champagne I use this one a lot but yeah you can tell they're just they're super metallic and very glittery not glittery but like intense <laughs> and I really like them but honestly that's gonna be everything for this update super quick little video um and yeah Definitely stay tuned because I have a lot more products that I'm ready to film. So honestly, you might be getting a lot of these updates um, like quicker than normal. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and definitely be sure to stay tuned for more and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.